Yo, what is up guys? It's Miss Creative Gaming here. And today I'm just bringing you a quick video to show you how to get the brand new Odin Two Sword style in a One Piece game. So some stuff I gotta clear up before we go there. You have to be in the second seat. They're not gonna move it to the first seat like they did with the Gear 4 raid. This is something that's exclusive to the second seat. It's probably one of the better swords in the game now. It might even be better than Griffin. I'm not 100% sure. But if you haven't made it to the second seat yet, you need to get to grinding. There's double XP in the first seat. Grind your stats, get here. It's 5k stats total. And you have to beat a law raid. Now, now, once you're here what you want to do is pull out your island tracker or if you want to just follow my lead in the video you just want to line yourself up with the blackbeard island right there and it's just directly behind that so you just go right behind that all right so unfortunately right as i was about to make it to the island the server shut down because there was a bug there's a pretty big bug happening so i have to uh yeah have to go all that way again so enjoy this montage of me boating all the way over to the island again <laughs> All right, we are finally here. It took forever, or it felt like forever at least. But first things first, you want to set your spawn 100%. Set it like 500 times. Now, this is up to you if you want to come here and grind out, but just otherwise, just skip this quest giver because he's just for the lower tier NPCs here. What you want to go for is right over there. I'm going to skip to where I'm up there at the new or at the better quest giver. So I'll go ahead and actually, I won't skip it. I'll just go ahead and speed it up so you know exactly where to go. All right, so once you're here, this is up to you as well. You don't have to do this, but you can go ahead and click this dude right here, and he will give you the quest for Odin. This will give you over 600 mil whenever you actually complete the quest. I've already tested it once. It's insane. It's so much money. But next, you just want to make yourself make your way all the way up the hill. But here's another NPC. It's not Odin, but this person does drop an accessory. I'm not too sure about the accessories right now. I have a video coming out about those later. But for now, there's her. Her accessory is, I think, something called like a fan of war or something. I'm not 100% sure. Then you just want to make your way all the way up here. Then you see Odin has spawned in right there. So the way I personally plan on doing it for now, because I'd like to get him grinded out a couple times tonight at least, running back and forth with the observation hockey on and whatnot, and then just getting out of his range when it's about to end, like this right here. And then look at how far he went. That's his spawn location this is where i'm at right now you know now that i'm looking at it there might not even be a way to really cheese this dude like look at that he is holy crap he is so far away if i shot him from here what do you aggro let's find out no okay so yeah you can cheese him pretty easily i wonder if you can do it i wonder if, if i could hit him from standing like right here let's say right here is he gonna come after me no okay yeah you could cheese him by doing just this if you have any range you just sit here aim at him and just spam your range to move maybe aim a little bit more up yeah, so just span your range moves from about right here at this cliffside, and that's another way to do it. But me personally, unless I'm AFK doing it, I'm going to do it like this right here just to get the maximum damage, do it as fast as possible. So I'm going to run because, like I said, he is he is a beast. So that way you don't want to run. If you're running from him, don't run that way. Run this way because he loses aggro a lot quicker that way than that way. He went so far that way. And boom, I went ahead and beat him. You see 605 mil. That's insane. But he has a 1% chance to drop his brand new swords. As soon as I get them, I'll drop a video showcasing them and showing you all the damage they do. Yeah, that's really it for the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Peace!